Funding for New Mexico in Focus provided by the McCune Charitable Foundation and the Nalita E. Walker Fund for KNME-TV, the KNME-TV Endowment Fund, and viewers like you. This week on New Mexico in Focus, is your p and energy bill about to go up? And so they want to raise the amount people pay for what they call fixed charges so that they can cover more of those fixed costs even as people consume less. And the line discusses the latest development in the behavioral health provider shakeup. Mexico in Focus starts now. Thanks for joining us for New Mexico in Focus. Later this hour, NMIF correspondent Megan Kamerick examines the community schools model with local and national leaders. And the line opinion panel discusses the latest news headlines. But first, there's just over two months before New Mexico voters go to the polls to decide which presidential candidate is best prepared to represent the Republican and Democratic Party in November. Both campaigns are aggressively targeting first time voters to help put their candidates over the top in delegate votes and New Mexico could play a decisive role. Our correspondent, Stan Wilson, recently sat down with two first-time voters to discuss their views on economic and social issues in New Mexico that candidates won't want to ignore. <laughs> 